హలో అండ్ నమస్తే బ్యూటిఫుల్ సెల్ఫ్ యు నో ద పర్సన్ హూ హ్యాడ్ ది హైయెస్ట్ ఇన్ఫ్లుయెన్స్ ఇన్ మై లైఫ్ హెస్ బీన్ మై ఫాదర్ ఫ్రమ్ అ యంగ్ ఏజ్ హీ నాట్ ఓన్లీ ఎన్కరేజ్ మీ టు పార్టిసిపేట్ ఇన్ many essay contests in talking contests where he put me on stage before a lot of people in front of a lot of people and and allowed me to chant offer prayers um give word of thanks and he made me feel very comfortable with people around not only did he do that he also encouraged me to go into dramatics uh he helped me learn and train in the indian dance and he was the one who encouraged me to connect with the nature by sending my lovely sister and myself into wilderness in in himalayas he and he did this much against the wishes of my brothers and other relatives but he he said let them go let them learn let them experience let them let them be part of the nature and i have faith in them i trust them they are going to make it so that was the faith that he had in me so he really exposed me to to everything in the universe he introduced me to the best books i have read in my life and he would spend hours together uh discussing with me about those books about the life he was the one who introduced me to the spirituality to the wisdom of the enlightened he introduced me to authentic texts on yoga like bhagavad gita and and many of the other deep spiritual knowledge he introduced me to many great masters and and through them i have learned a lot he was a man who was very straightforward very honest he never sugar coated words and therefore he wasn't a very popular person amidst many of my family members and relatives he called spade the spade he he would just say things on the face like he he could call me your arrogant and rude and he never said it because he was simply angry about me and just the words came out he said it because i really was arrogant and rude at the time when he said that and if i could only objectively look at myself that way i would realize that he was not fall he was not falsely accusing me of that but he he really gave his observation in a very straightforward way and and i i could realize that about my own behavior he was so honest so uncorrupt that he went to a very large extent of personal suffering in his career because he he just wouldn't budge down to be dishonest to give any false statement um about about any of the things and and because of that he was put into lot of trouble by his seniors in the office but he he was really strong that he withstood all that but he he stood for the values and the principles that had taken deep root in him and as i observed him do those things and as he would share what he went through trying to uphold those values they really created a very deep impact in me and uh, although he's not there now in the physical world he lives with me every moment of my life every time i teach yoga it is his words his knowledge his touch on my life is what i am sharing with the world my name is shanti from yoga for happiness.com